Hi, this is George Black and Nicholas. I'm making another economics video today. Uh, today we're going to be looking at the oligopoly market structure and as my case study I've chosen buses in Oxford. <laughs> The reason uh, the buses in Oxford works quite well as an example of oligopoly market structure is an oligopoly is a market in which uh, a handful of firms, maybe two, three, four firms, have a very high market concentration. That is to say, combined, they have a very large market share. In Oxford, we've got two main bus companies. We've got the Stagecoach Buses and the Oxford Bus Company. What we can see behind me here in Gloucester Green is you can see the flagship um, coach service to London that's operated by Stagecoach, the Oxford Tube and the grey ones. Um, they are the uh, London and the airport uh, coach services operated by the Oxford Bus Company. So I'm going to take a, a run now around Oxford, particularly looking at the major arterial routes to the south, to the north, to the east and the west, having a look at the buses that are running out of the city centre today and just proving to you that they are operated really by only two main bus services. And what does that say therefore about the market structure of buses in Oxford? So right now I'm settling in the middle of Queen Street. Um, so this is the main arterial route out of Oxford if you want to head anywhere to the east of the city. Um, you'd be going to Marston, Wood Farm, Blackbird Lees, Cowley, Headington or even further afield on like the Thornhill Park and Ride or even up to London. And as you can see there's loads of buses, loads of buses behind me. Um, this one just here, that's an uh, Oxford uh, bus company bus, presumably going somewhere like Marston or perhaps even the JR Hospital. Um, there's another um, Oxford bus company bus right behind me. You can see it's not in service at the moment, presumably just stopping off. Uh, a little bit of that grey bus you can see just leaving now is a Oxford bus company, sorry, an Oxford Brooks bus which is operated by the Oxford bus company. There is uh, going past me there I'm not sure what that is and um, the pink one that you can see just behind there that's a Blackbird Leeds bus so that's Oxford bus company the one behind that that's Oxford bus company as well the red one pulling out is Oxford bus company so it's all bus bus company that uh, that chap there uh, is an Oxford bus company employee I've got to get out of the way and that white one behind me is an Oxford bus company one going to the airport and the purple one just behind me was a Oxford bus company parking ride so I haven't really seen much stagecoach action going on here. It all seems to be Oxford Bus Company. Maybe they've got this eastern route all, uh, all to themselves for the moment. So I'm currently in St Old Eights, again packed with buses. Uh, the two ones in front of me, you can see red buses are Oxford Bus Company buses. I think there's another one coming up behind me. That's a stagecoach bus. So St Old Eights is the main arterial route um, going to the south of Oxford, say uh, that's a London bus, but that's the Oxford Bus Company bus, the Express. So we're still at St Aldate's, again getting packed with buses now, stagecoach. Oh that's interesting, so that's a National Express bus, that's neither bus company or stagecoach. So this is St Giles, this is the main uh, northern arterial route outside of Oxford, this is where you catch a bus if you were going to Summertown or anywhere along the Banbury Road, Woodstock Road. You can see behind me a couple of uh, Oxford Bus Company buses. Um, you're about to see a Thames Travel Bus, which is neither Oxford Bus Company nor Stagecoach. Um, an anomaly. Let's move on. So this is St Giles coming the other way now. Um, so these are the buses coming from the north. Stagecoach Gold Bus right in front of us. The blue bus coming behind us is uh, an Oxford bus company bus. There's a stagecoach just parking up behind and the purple one here, Oxford bus company and bus park and ride. So it's coming from the northern park and ride. St Giles again. Those are the buses coming out of Oxford and these are the buses going into Oxford. So this is known as Fry's Wide Square. Uh, right next to the Oxford Hotel, we've had a stagecoach pass, uh, pass us. Uh, and then that's the Said Business School, part of Oxford University. And then just in front of us there is the Oxford Railway Station. So this lies along the main arterial route going to the west of Oxford. Uh, here is a red Oxford Bus Company bus. 
so that's going to the railway station. Um, you'd come to the west really if you were going to anywhere like Botley or Chipping Norton, uh, Whitney perhaps. As you can see again, Stagecoach, Oxford Bus Company got it all sewn up. So I've just gone a little bit further and actually run to the train station just to make a point. There we go, Blackbird Leeds bus, Oxford Bus Company bus. Purple one is Oxford Bus Company, the red one in the far distance is Oxford Bus Company. And there is another um, smaller bus, I'm wondering if you can see it there. Just there in the far distance, that's a stagecoach bus, I'm not quite sure where it's going to. So this is it. This is the HQ of the Oxford Bus Company or Oxford Bus Comp because they've lost some of the lettering on their building. Uh, it is just off the ring road, the Oxford Ring Road, and it is just over the road from the uh, mini factory that you can see behind me, which is one of our Oxford's largest employers. You can see in the background there, it's got one of the red buses that we've seen uh, in town. You can't see it, but behind the mini factory, beyond the mini factory over there, is actually the Stagecoach HQ as well. So, despite being uh, very competitive, uh, they clearly uh, are very close to each other in terms of geographical location. To the side of it now, and you can see all the different buses that we've seen coming into and out of Oxford. Just there. Right, that's it, let's go and find the Stagecoach one. So I've come out to the uh, Stagecoach HQ, which as you can see behind me, you can see the Oxford tube buses there, Ooh. and a gold one just behind me, we've seen plenty of those in Oxford, uh, centre of Oxford, we've seen plenty of the Oxford tube buses in Gloucester Green, there's another gold bus and a white double decker behind me, uh, a green bus, don't know where that goes. Just to make the point though, that Stagecoach is a nationwide uh, company, operates nationally, uh, doesn't just operate in Oxford, but of course it is one of the two major bus companies operating in Oxford as well. And I think together with the Oxford bus, Oxford bus Company, it does make the Oxford bus market an oligopoly.